Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis with a quick tip about something to not do with your wood stove. I use wood heating as my primary heat source all winter. That's what's keeping our house warm. And one of the things I love about wood stoves is that you can essentially you just use scrap and waste to keep your uh, house warm, keep your house comfortable. I can just go outside, pick up sticks or whatever, and throw them in here and it creates a, a comfortable living environment. That can also be used for all sorts of scrap things. If you've got old pallets or scrap cardboard or any of that type of stuff, you can throw it in and same kind of deal. You're taking waste and turning it into something useful and valuable. I tried using a type of waste recently that I'm in this video going to suggest you don't use though, and I wanted to share it with you so you don't make the same mistake I did. Uh, I bought some bulk olive oil and I did not end up using up all of it and some of it went rancid and I was thinking, well, olive oil burns, why don't I just take some of that and what I would do is I would take uh, milk uh, cartons and after they're empty of milk, just paper, I'd dry them out, put some olive oil in the bottom and while the wood stove fire is going, I'd put it in and boy did it burn really well, it would kind of spatter and get on the wood and it created a lot of heat for the house, but what it also created was a lot of mess, uh, especially down in the bottom tray here that collects the ash. Uh, a lot of the olive oil would just kind of pour down in there and it didn't completely disappear and burn up. Uh, there was a lot of uh, like chunky scab kind of stuff and I'm able to get it up. I've been using a little chisel to kind of slowly pick the stuff up. Um, it's not the end of the world, it wasn't a huge disaster. And I would mention, I do not have the catalytic uh, uh, burning uh, filter in here, the thing with all the platinum or whatever in there. Uh, if I'd had that installed, I would not have even tried putting olive oil in there. Uh, this does not have that catalytic uh, combustor, uh, whatever installed. Um, but yeah, it created a lot of heat, but it also created an awful lot of mess. And I just don't think that it was worth it. So if you were ever, uh, you know, heating your house with a wood stove and you got some old olive oil. I mean, the best thing you can do with olive oil is use it for cooking, but if it goes rancid, you want to find a use for it. I'd suggest maybe if you got like wooden axe handles, you could use it for soaking wooden axe handles so that they, uh, you know, keep their axe head on. Um, don't burn it though. I mean, outside is one thing, but uh, it made a real mess. It was not worth the uh, benefit that I got out of it. That's it. Just a quick tip, pro tip for someone that's made the mistake. So hopefully you can avoid making it. That's it. Thanks for watching. This episode has been brought to you in part by Prescott Caliber Club and Jeske Defense Strategies. Prescott Caliber Club is a federally licensed firearm manufacturer and retail store specializing in firearms, survival gear, and producing great online content. If you want to thank them for supporting this channel, go check them out at prescottcalclub.com. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.